Welcome to the Unseen Hour, where we explore the mysterious and unexplained events that have left us all intrigued. In today's episode, we dive into one of the most perplexing mysteries of the 20th century, the Dyatlov Pass incident. On a frigid winter night in 1959, a group of experienced hikers ventured into the remote Ural Mountains in Russia. But what was meant to be a routine expedition quickly turned into a tragedy that has puzzled investigators and captured the public's imagination for over six decades. Join us as we unravel the enigma of the Dyatlov Pass incident and try to make sense of what really happened on that fateful night. In 1959, a group of experienced hikers set out for a trek through the Ural Mountains in Russia. They never returned. Their tent was found torn open from the inside, and the hikers' bodies were discovered in various states of undress, some with injuries that defied explanation. The incident became known as the Dyatlov Pass incident, and to this day, it remains one of the most baffling unsolved mysteries in modern history. The hikers were all students from the Ural Polytechnical Institute, led by 23-year-old Igor Dyatlov. They were experienced hikers who had gone on multiple expeditions before. They set out for their trek on January 23, 1959, carrying supplies and equipment for the trip. When the hikers failed to return on schedule, a search and rescue team was sent out. On February 26, they found the abandoned tent on the slopes of Kolat Syakal, also known as Dead Mountain. It was torn open from the inside, with the hikers' belongings still inside. The footprints in the snow suggested that the hikers had fled the tent in a panic. The search party eventually found the first two bodies, about a mile away from the tent. They were shoeless, wearing only underwear, and had died of hypothermia. The next three bodies were found in a ravine, with more serious injuries. One had a skull fracture, and another had chest fractures. The last four bodies were found months later, buried under the snow. They had died of hypothermia. The injuries sustained by the hikers have led to multiple theories about what happened. Some suggest that an avalanche caused the injuries, but others argue that the slope was too shallow for an avalanche. Some speculate that the hikers were attacked by a yeti or some other mysterious creature, but there is no evidence to support this. Some even suggest that the Soviet government was involved, but again, there is no evidence to support this theory. The official investigation concluded that the hikers had died of hypothermia, but it did not provide an explanation for the injuries. The case was closed, and the incident remained a mystery for decades. In the 1990s, a new investigation was opened, but it failed to provide any new answers. The Dyatlov Pass incident remains a haunting and perplexing mystery. The circumstances of the hikers' deaths defy explanation, and the various theories only add to the confusion. Despite multiple investigations and countless hours of speculation, we may never know what truly happened on that fateful night on Dead Mountain. The Dyatlov Pass incident remains one of the most perplexing mysteries of our time. Despite numerous investigations and theories, we may never know the full truth of what happened to those nine hikers on that cold February night. But what we do know is that their story will continue to fascinate and intrigue us for years to come. It is a reminder of the power and mystery of the natural world and the fragility of human life. Thank you for joining us on this journey and we look forward to bringing you more captivating mysteries in the future.